Hi, welcome back with a new assignment week 3. Deep learning from IIT Rapport. And coming to the week 3 assignment, we are having a few questions based on the same question uh, which has given in the introduction part and uh, based on that only we are having all the 10 questions. So you can see the question here, use the following data to answer the questions below. So here we are having uh, one uh, neural networks which is having input layer, hidden layer, hidden layer 2 and output layer. And we are having uh, weight vectors W1, W2, W3 and there is an input vector X and the target value Y is equal to 10. So what are the total number of parameters in the following network? So it is, uh, the answer is 17. What is the predicted output for a given input X1 after doing the forward pass? So we have to choose the closest uh, answer that is 7.33. Compute and enter the loss between the output generated by input X and uh, true output Y. This is approximately equal to 22. It is not exactly 22. It is approximately equal to nearest value. If we call the predicted y as y cap and then what is the gradient dl by dy cap? L is the loss function. So it is nearly equal to minus 5.17. <coughs> what is the sum of the elements of uh, delta w3? That is, uh, it is nothing but error, error w3. That is uh, minus 12.14. So what is the sum of the elements of uh, error W2? That is 1.41. The same question is repeated uh, for uh, 6 and 7. Uh, so the values are 1.41. What is the probability of all the events X1, X2, so on Xn in a system is equal to N greater than 1? What can you say about the entropy H of X of other system? That is H of X uh, greater than or equal to 1. Let P and Q be the two probability distributions and what conditions will the cross entropy between P and Q is minimized P is equal to Q. Suppose we have a problem where data X and label Y are related by Y is equal to X squared plus 1. What, which of the following is not a good choice for the activation function in the hidden layer? If the activation function at the output layer is linear. So that is linear. You can submit the answers. Once the answers are uh, submitted, assessment submitted can be seen. If you have any doubts regarding the queries uh, or questions, you can comment in the comment box so that we can discuss more about in detail about the questions. Uh, that's all for today and we can meet in the week 4 assignment. Thank you.